Good Friday morning. Well, what do we have here? Let's see, grilling, sauteing, pan frying, whirl, butter taste and better. Liquid shortening. One thing I've been learning about making these Waffle House videos is they use liquid shortening. Not this one. I think Waffle House uses Kaola Gold from what I've read online. Uh, they, they all come in like one gallon containers. There's Wesson Low Melt. I would have liked to have tried that, I think. It comes in a metal can. But you have to buy in bulk and it would have cost me $80. This was 20 something. So is Kaola Gold. You can buy them on Amazon. The reason I bought Whirl is the ingredient list uh, just seems to be much shorter than the Kaola Gold. But they have one thing in common. All of these liquid shortenings, even the vintage ones, they have lecithin. Lecithin. And lecithin brings non-stick properties to, to these emulsions. I have cooked with butter and ghee in visions and corning, but we have to try liquid shortening with lecithin. There is some information about making your own. You can buy liquid lecithin on Amazon. And some people make their own liquid spray uh, oils, adding lecithin. Ingredients, soybean oil, hydrogenated soybean oil, contains 2% or less of salt, sunflower, lecithin, artificial butter flavor, beta carotene for coloring, yeast extract. Maybe one day I'll try the Kaola Gold Maybe we'll try to make our own. We're gonna swirl this into our Corningware 908B and our Visions V9 skillets. We're gonna cook one egg in each and we're gonna see if the eggs just slide. And we're gonna make some breakfast. See if this lecithin really aids in the slipperiness of these pans. Let's stop yapping and let's get cooking. It's a bubble egg. That was a weird one. Isn't that a weird one? That's a weird one. That is really loose. That is really sliding. I think the lecithin really did help. I've made eggs slide with butter and ghee. These seem to glide a little bit better. You know what I'm gonna say. Thanks for watching.